Does everybody, does everybody know what time it is? Tools time! That's right, Ben for Tools is proud to present Space Rogue. That's right, it's tool time again. First, as always, the updates. Metasploit is up to version 3.7.1. Skipfish is now at version 1.8.8. The Nessus DB is up to version 1.4.2. OpenDLP is now at version 0.3.1. NetSparker is at version 1.9.0.5. Huh? Oh, that's it. And Microsoft's EMT is now at version 2.1. And a week without Sys internals updates is like a week without tool time. This week it was VM Map, RAM Map, Handle, and Process Explorer. So check your sources and go update already. And now, into the fresh. Not Fuzzier is a powerful browser fuzzier based on MangleMe. It fuzzes HTML, CSS tags, JavaScript, and DOM objects. Safe 3 SQL Injector is a powerful and easy to use tool to automate detection and exploitation of SQL injection flaws. It includes support for HTTPS, various auth schemes, POST, and has full support for just about everything BugDB2. Malbox Malware Analysis System is a behavior analysis system that considers both network and local behaviors when generating a report on the program you pointed at. So if you're firing off 20 sysinternals utilities to see what something is doing, you might want to have a look-see at this. Pitybull is an intrusion detection framework for Snort and Suricata. It's basically like the old stick program in that you can use it to test the detection and blocking of either one. It will send non-RFC compliant packets, fragmented packets, shell codes, and reverse shells, and can employ various evasion techniques. So yeah, it's quite a bit more than stick. Yeti is a network fingerprinting tool. It will do domain discovery, forward lookup brooding, reverse lookups, Bing searching, search scraping, and integrates with Nmap and SQLite. Not sure I would send a Yeti in to do my recon, but uh, this Yeti looks pretty useful for that. If you're into malware analysis, then check out Cuckoo from the HoneyNet project. Cuckoo is another project from the Google Summer of Code, and it has hit .2 beta. Cuckoo is a lightweight malware analysis sandbox. It performs automated dynamic analysis of provided Windows binaries. It's able to return comprehensive reports on key API calls and network activity. And then we have Dominator, which is a Firefox-based software for analysis and identification of DOM-based XSS. It uses dynamic runtime tainting model on strings and can trace back taint propagation operations in order to understand if a DOM XSS vulnerability is actually exploitable. And on a final note, most of us have already recompiled Netcat out of annoyances at AV's insistence that it is a virus. Well, someone finally put up another distro for the rest of you. It's for Windows, and for some reason it's now called RCAT. Anyway, it's up at Packet Storm. That's it for this week's Tool Time. Join us next week for our salute to Tool Time. <laughs>